Howdy folks, it is the Command Line Volpine here, and welcome back to Let's Play Backpack Hero, where we're moving on to the next floor. We beat the boss on this floor. No problem. Oh, this is just the same biome. I thought we were going into a new biome. That makes sense, then. That wasn't the actual, like, boss of this floor. Isn't it like a king bee or something? Queen bee or something? That seems familiar. Unknown event is here. Oh, my. The retiring chef. Age has crept in around his snoot, and you can see the white fur and shaggy edges from around his coat. I'm getting out of the game, he says. If you have something to eat, I might as well give you my cleaver. Trade food for a cleaver, yeah. Oh, the cleaver is the thing that stacks. These are both common. Let's see, maybe if I had something better, he would, uh... It's good to me. Can't believe that he eats the whole thing without a moment's thought. Here you go. He says and hands you his knife. Won't be needing this anymore. The cleaver is the one that has the synergy for... He's cleaver. Deals 10 damage. All adjacent and diagonal cleavers are used. We don't have any other cleavers, though. That's what I thought the hatchets were, but no. Okay. You don't have other cleavers. It does cost a lot of energy to use. We're probably not going to use it yet. Obviously, it would do 13 if it was attached to this. Actually, it is attached to that, and I didn't even think about that. <laughs> okay. Love that knife. Use it well. That looks like a bunch of HP, and I don't need HP yet. Chest of valuables. I'm out of inventory space, though. Unstable mana. 10 damage to all enemies on use. It's just better than a regular mana stone, right? Because I can potentially consume it in an emergency situation. Dark Lady's Potion. Deals 18 damage and that's destroyed. Magical Herb. I'm thinking I could get more. I had got that thing a long time ago that produced herbs. We might have like a magic weapon. Warrant. We kind of have two runs going at the same time, which isn't great. I'm going to leave that there because it looks like HP. We'll come back to it if we need it. Eight damage, and you're gonna curse me. Don't think we're gonna be able to take out the rabbit in one turn. The rabbit knows you're in its garden. Sparrow knife, protect your head. But why are you disabled? Aren't you connected to two mana? Ah, uh, this isn't a connection. Oops. Okay, well, we're in a little bit of trouble then. Let's see, 11 damage, 13 damage, 24 damage, 2 poison. This is 4 damage to all enemies. Man, I messed up. We're gonna be, gonna be in a world of hurt this time, I think. I have to block twice to block all the damage from you. To block once to block most of it. Let's see if we can. We could probably kill the sparrow in one turn, right? Okay, you're down. Thirteen damage to you. Do four poison to you. I don't know what caused the poison sickness. This is just like a random chance, like a five percent chance on poison damage to do that. I don't think I want to take a ton of damage, so I think I'm gonna to have to do one block. We'll just poison him. Maybe it just, maybe that just indicates that they're not going to be able to act that turn because they're going to die from poison. That might be all it is. All right, 12 damage. I could block twice to defeat you. Or to block the damage you're going to cause. Which I probably will do just to play it safe. Messed up by... Messed up by 
messing up my knife setup there. Or my wand setup. I win. Crooked arrow. Oh, our arrow's not fired anymore. Do they actually stay in your inventory? I think they were fired in the past, weren't they? Which kind of made it difficult to use because you didn't know if you would run out of ammo or not. Okay, well, let's fix our inventory for one thing. It's all conductive. spicy we expand our inventory more we do the one to get this corner i don't think we can but probably this corner we're here a lot of options actually all right which fish is the best i feel like just straight hp is pretty good so we'll just leave it the way it is uh don't think there's anything i want to throw out we could switch something for a dagger but i like the free use free to use items Dungeon is collapsing here. What's that mean? <laughs> what do you even mean? The forge. Many items can be upgraded at the forge. The forge costs money, but you can use it multiple times. Each forge has different upgrades, so be sure to check. You can see how many upgrades an item can receive on its card. If it can be upgraded, there will be a number in the bottom right next to the anvil symbol. Badger stands by her anvil, her arms strong and resilient from years spent in the dungeon. She nods at you, I forge, she says. Badgers aren't much for words upgrade, she asks. One rage to a melee weapon. I don't remember what rage did. Haste to a structure, conductive to armor, block to a shield. I feel like making our shield better for an emergency would be pretty good. Since it's such a small shield anyway, it's... I hope. <laughs> It's just such a small shield anyway. It's not really weighing us down. I don't know what that means. Be like Badger. All right. Three enemies. Ten damage. I can block your damage with one stamina now. So if I can kill you, we'll be in a good spot. 14 damage. Poison, 14 damage. Eleven damage and two poison. Get us to six poison damage. I think this is exactly enough to beat you. Might just be better to use this, though. Because everything is getting poisoned. Okay, that's all that means. Okay. We were correct. Just going to block the rest of the damage here. Yeah, Necronomicon is just insane. We should probably work on eliminating one of these builds, which is very sad because these are both legendary items. Well, I can still use all the free attacks, right? You're toasted. so strong. <laughs> I'm even like forgetting some of the things we can do. Okay, so we're out of room there. We can probably, yeah. That expands you there. Okay. 
Okay. Is hat armor? It is. Great space below. To block. We like our hatchets, though. Use to re-roll your combat rewards. Hmm. Rats don't eat flies. What do you do? <laughs> I'm just assuming that if I get it out of the dungeon, I'll get a bonus for it. Spoiled milk. Lots of block adds poison to myself. Well, that's a that's a no-brainer. It's a legendary hat. I don't really want to get rid of it, but if I have any armor, these get weakened considerably. Guess I'm just gonna take your poison, and I guess I'll take the die. Fights. I'm prioritizing the fights because we have a big heal back here. I assume it's a big heal. She's still there, so I could go back to her if I wanted. Gerbil Ruffian. Rumor has it that gerbils used to be pets before the founding of Orderia. These overgrown monsters make you doubt it. Deep Lore. It'll add two damage when it attacks. Ooh. Yeah, this is a little bit of a beefier encounter here. <laughs> the thing is, I could sit here and do a lot of math and get it perfectly right, or I can play the game. <laughs> okay, you're taking four damage, so you have 12 health. You're dead. Assumedly, if I do the exact same thing to you, you will also perish. You're dead. Eight block. I can do, do that. I'm sure I can't defeat you this turn, so I will just pop my block. You're going to do a little bit more than eight damage, though. So I could either block both. I can make sure I block all the damage, or... Just start doing damage to you, but I think we're gonna block and then we'll just use our our free attacks. Maybe it's already accounted for in here. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if it's already accounted for or not in that number. I feel like if it was already accounted for, it wouldn't even bother telling you, right? Got so many legendary weapons right away, it's insane. Battle ring. We already got one. We don't really use it. There's a cleaver. Okay. A key sword. For each diagonal or adjacent or diagonal key on use deals or adds plus two damage and deals two damage. Okay. Liquid armor. That's a big block. Okay. Um Want to keep the lucky lucky ring? I do want the cleaver. So I think we. I'm not using the battle ring. I think we're gonna ditch the battle ring. Add a cleaver. This one automatically uses adjacent cleavers, right? So now that's a very strong. Again, we <laughs> we have like three different builds going on at the same time, but it's working. It's poison. I haven't really seen a need to reroll stuff. Take the liquid armor. This isn't connected. Let's connect it. You know, I don't have six mana laying around. 
We get rid of you and keep this. All right. It's an incredibly strong run. Purple referee and a vol. What is this? What is that gonna? What do you even do? Like, will it game over me if I go back here? Or will I take damage when I pass through this tile? And this is a different health icon than the other ones we've seen. So let's do the fights and stuff first anyway, I guess. All right. I'm pretty sure nothing can stand in my path. Because you do 13 damage, you do 7 damage. So this is 20 damage just to click this. But also, it's like not even necessary. <laughs> oh, he's not quite as dead as I hoped. Now you're dead. All right, you. Six damage. I should probably block. I guess we'll find out. Let's try to pay attention to how much damage it deals. It says six here, and then it's going to do two more, I think. Can't use the big cleaver yet. <laughs> or I can't use it now, I should say. Pop you. By the way, I'm definitely not like min maxing perfectly. I am aware. It's gonna be a lot of that in this game. There's gonna be a lot of things that you guys see that I don't see. All right, let's see the damage. She is six, so it, it is accounted for up here. That's good to know. <laughs> okay. Potted aloe. Heals six HP, removes five poison. Oh, there's another cleaver. Okay. Now we're getting cramped for space. getting very strong unfortunate if we do a big reorganization we can probably make this work but we want oh you're not getting the bonus you would get the bonus though if we change things crap <laughs> dark ladies potion conductive okay I don't necessarily need all these shivs for one thing, but I would like to get the dark wand into the conversation of bonus damage. And I would like to get all three cleavers into the conversation of bonus damage. Is such a thing possible? I do not know. I'm just going to kind of clear things out. You know, sort of sort things like these are things that are not location dependent. All those can be anywhere and it's fine. Okay. I have to lean in here. This is something I could, I could do this off camera, but again, this is like 90% of the game. So I don't think I should do it off camera necessarily. Okay. That makes it so all the cleavers have bonus damage, which is incredibly strong. I would love to get dark. I'd like to get bonus damage on the dark wand. I don't know if it's possible with our inventory space, though. It would have to have think I can squeeze it in here. If we expand this side, we will. So I think for now, we don't really sweat it. That's all correct. Can't fit more of these in. There's just no way. So is any of these things conductive so we can keep them on the conductive network here? I don't think so. Of 
There's items that are here, but... All right. Block. That, that, that. Question becomes is an extra shiv worth a potion. I'm not sure that it is anymore. Since I can't give them any kind of bonus, I don't think it's really worth it. I think our consumables are probably worth more now. Six. Not necessary to rotate these. I'm not sure how I... I it said to like right click to rotate and I did just click something on my mouse. and uh, I don't know. In case we get ponies and this seems pretty good. There. We're going to leave it like that. If we level up, I think we can get some more stuff done all right merchant selling goods can i save the game there we go just because i don't know what this is gonna do it sucked to like lose our run to like this collapsing behind us ah that's okay it makes a branch in the path that's fine i would have been more concerned if it like hurt us a spade cleaver it's different Four damage. When a cleaver kills a non-summon enemy, it gets plus one damage this combat. Four. Is it just better? It has the same base damage. So I think it's just better. It's weird that it's not a different level of common a heart ring adds five max hp when it removes i lose five i do basically just have extra space right now it's probably worth it all right let's go see what this is this might just be money and not hp let's go find out what it is Oh, it's just XP. Never mind. <laughs> go back to the forge or the merchants. I guess let's go to the merchants. I don't think you could go back and forth in the older version of this game. Lightning. Projectile, conductive. Deals four damage to all enemies. Each turn... It fires automatically, but it's huge, right? Yeah. Hmm. I feel like there might be a way to cram this in here. It's interesting. A shortcut map used to discover a secret passage. It's legendary. I mean, hopefully it's worth it. How much money we got? 29. Oh, I can't even afford it. We can make you do seven damage to all enemies every turn if we can fit you in. Takes up four spaces in a zigzag pattern. I can't afford it. Oh yeah, I can sell things too. He ate it? When I clicked on it, is that good? Ah, uh, everything's on sale now. I can get both. Okay. So much like long division and figuring out where things go. I would like to do that, make this, put this in a place where it can do 
bonus damage though. Okay. This isn't doing bonus damage anymore, but now it is. <laughs> It's all connected. Be nice if I could use this right now so I could carry more. I'm gonna take the key because I probably need it for the secret passage. I want my luck ring. I want this. I'm losing my consumables and two stabby boys. So this is gonna fire every turn and deal seven damage every turn to everything. I think that is worth losing two attacks at two damage. <laughs> Alright. How do I... I want to buy anything? I guess if I can get... Can I just go, like, to a random room? Oh. Oh, it reopened this path. I'm not sure that was... Since it was on discount, it was probably fine, but I don't think it was worth it. You are done with this full worth of OMR. I have time for this video. I hope you've all enjoyed. If you did, remember to hit the like button. Keep the conversation going in the comments and subscribe if you'd like to see more. And until next time, I hope you have a good day.